What is Trevor doing? Is why you never talk unkindly to strangers, my friend. Hey guys and welcome back to some more GTA and we're back and we've just swapped back to Trevor and don't know who brothers. Don't know who Brad is, but I don't know what he's doing to that guy under there, under the pier. Look how many. He's got four, five strange and fruits missions. And he's just got two normal missions. So I think we'll see which one's the closest and we'll just. We'll just do it by that, I think. So let's uh, go ahead and see. Oh, so it'd be this one with Trevor, okay. Oh, it's the old house thing. Okay, let's, let's go here then. It's the closest one. Just have to mile. That won't take us a minute to get there. Okay, saying that, it probably takes longer now, won't it? Oh my god, what have I crashed into everything? That is not moving. As well as moving. That's for sure. Who the fuck is this? this? Oh, we can do more than talk, my friend. Okay, we need to go to the warehouse. Let's get rid of that waypoint then. Okay, so I guess if we want to, we can change the Michael, or we meant to change the Michael. I guess, let's, let's change and see what happens. Let's change and see what happens then. As it's flashing. What's Michael up to? Ah, uh, gotta quit that shit. How is it? Yeah, I know. I take speed mostly. Look at me. Boom. Best shape of my life. Yeah. Yeah. I can still take you, sugar tits. That's because you're fucking deranged, not because you're in good shape. Hey, why don't you stick doing fucking crunches and feeling bad about yourself, all right, pork chop? Hey, fuck you. You know, I'm beginning to think that's exactly what you want to do. Yeah. Jesus. Just said the same fucking thing to my wife. Did you see his face that last time I popped him? <laughs> Boom! Oh, ladies! God, you're an asshole. You, you back there. I know you, but you? You, I don't know. Yeah, well, until I see reason otherwise, why don't we just keep it that way? Steve, what a pleasure, bro. Oh! <laughs> it reminds me of one of those guys you see advertising pills for middle-aged men that can't get erections. <laughs> hey, Devin Weston is a very good friend of mine, so why don't you watch your tongue? Because let me tell you something, that guy gets more tail than, uh... <laughs> than a tail catcher! <laughs> I have to fucking remember that line. You, where did we meet? Nowhere, pal. Yeah, we did. Hey, oh, what are we doing here, huh? This. Please, keep the sleep best of the way from me. No, oh, no, no, Ferdinand, he's gone. He's gone. It's okay, I've got some new friends here now. No, this okay. is Michael, and this, this is Trevor. No. Now, our friend here, he claims he doesn't know I anything. Don't, I don't know anything. I don't know. I already told nothing. Nothing. I don't know anything. Please. Please. Sir. You know about the Azerbaijanis? Huh? Azerbaijanis. I do audiovisual, hi-fi audiovisual. It's top man, good price. VIP. No? no. You're so. a fucking spy. <laughs> and the asswipes at the agency know this. No. So I need to know. What did you tell them? What did they tell you? I told, hmm? I told them what I tell you. Uh huh. What? I. Hey. This whoa, whoa, whoa! What is this? The house in Rockwood Hills. The man who owns it. He works at the consulate. Oh, that's all I know. That's it. That's it. That's it. I go. You're gonna make him speak. No, 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 no. You I two are gonna drive up to Rockford Hills. No. And when we find out which man is the man with the problem, you put him down. Because I'm tired of these fucking nitwits at the agency taking all the glory. Let me go. Hey, fuck is all this, huh? I think it's a good time, buddy. You know, go for a drive. Wait, wait. 
<laughs> you get to work, and uh, I'm not here. <laughs> the guy's your neighbor. Caesar's Place, Rockford Hills. Okay, so Trevor's gonna, I guess, terrorize him and get on of him while we try and find yeah, who we want out of him to tell us, I guess. I, like him. I was you, I wouldn't be so critical of who others associate with. If that makes sense. So I don't think that last bit makes problem? sense. But I think you know what I mean. Sure. But there's nothing we can do about it. If something happened to him right now, I'd be right under a microscope. An electron microscope of bureaucratic shit. That would make it very difficult to keep old secrets. Oh, well, boo -hoo 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 for you. You know who else is having trouble keeping secrets, asshole? Me. After you brought Trevor in on this. I only brought him in after you put out your Okay, I was going straight, but then. The fucking way. It's a bit back there, I clicked off. Out your press clicked off. And, uh, taking yeah, stores crashed again. again. The Los Santos reboot. If we didn't control the situation and he'd unearth this connection, then what? Then Trevor flips out, beheads me, kills my family, or raises them as his own. Or raises them as his own. I don't know which is worse. Anyway, any of that could happen at any time. Slow down. Let's think this through. What does he know? He knows I'm alive. He knows I got money. And now he knows I'm working with the FIB. Does he know how long you've been working with the FIB? How long? The fuck does that matter? Either you were working with us before the cash depot job, you walked you walked your crew into an ambush, one of them spent ten years on the run, and the other landed in a federal penitentiary. Or, or, we stumbled on the cash depot job, Brad went down, you went down, Trevor got away, the FIB cut you a deal on your sickbed, faked your death, and you end up here. Who's to say which of those is true? That there's any doubt probably accounts for you being alive. Back there, Trevor made you right away. Oh, the second it. he saw you. You remember after the bust, I was in all the papers. I was on the evening news. The man who killed Michael Townley. If the money ran out, this is bullshit. This place, Davy. They've been shooting the real cunts of suburbia here the last few weeks. No way that's your guy. Shit. You are kidding me. I'll call Steve. Okay, so he's not here. But what's he going to say next? Wrong house. This guy isn't our guy. Okay, okay, okay. You sure you don't silence him just to make sure? If we're silencing someone, we're silencing the right someone. Get me another address. Hey, you want a coffee? Okay, it's fine to talk to Mr. K. Okay. We need a new address from Mr. K. Choose your instrument and go to work on it. Where do we start, eh, buddy? Wait, what are you talking about, the wrong guy? No! Who do you want? Just tell me what you want! Huh, man? Huh, please! Look at me, please! Oh shit, okay, what should we use to torture him? Come should we go for the electric first, or...? Patriotic duty. I don't know what he's gonna do with all this stuff. Let's Just go for... Tell me what to say. Let's go for these first. Tell me where to start. Uh, are any of those teeth less useful than the others? Let me find it! I'm gonna take his teeth no. out. No, 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 no! Oh, I'll turn to go for two. So I'll just wait for him to do something. Here we go. Think about your tooth, mate. Best way to make a man talk is to stop him being able to talk. That hurts too much. Mr. Phillips, ask him about Tahir Javan. What didn't you ask me? I know Tahir. I did his home theater. <laughs> he lives in Chumash. The right on the Western Highway. Well, that wasn't so tough, was it? Uh, huh? <laughs> did you get that? Did you hear him? Lives in Chumash, the Western Highway. <laughs> no, they're right. having a coffee. You're driving. Remember, terror does not take coffee breaks. <sighs> what a dick. That's literally, mate. 
Okay, so we've got to go to Chumash. Chumash. Oh, another, another nice little drive. So how are Steve and Trevor getting along? Seems like a productive relationship. Well, like I said, he's got his uses. And as you can see, we're trying to take full advantage of them. Then what? This thing with the agency gets put to rest and we don't need you anymore. Right. And what about Trevor? What about him? I need some resolution, Davey. You let him walk. You said you'd clean the whole thing up back in North Yankton. And you told me it'd be a clean job. No casualties. There were more eyes on that. Oh, More eyes on that town than they needed. Yeah, well, according to my eyes, Trevor's your problem, Dave, as much as he is mine. He's not a problem at all. We're monitoring him. Has he said anything about Brad? Fuck yeah, he has. Plenty. I keep changing the subject. You know, he thinks you might actually commute Brad's sentence when this is all over. That's good. Fine work. We'll send another letter. It's about time anyway. Oh, so that's you who's been sending those fucking letters to Trevor, huh? Yeah. He thinks they're from Brad, who he thinks is locked up in high security and not, well, not six feet under in a grave marked Michael Town. The trainees write them. It's a good exercise. Yeah, the fuck. How'd that get started? A few years oh, ago, God, a letter came from the federal prison system addressed to Brad. It wasn't signed, but it gave a P.O. box in Sandy Shores. I played the part of Brad, and we started a correspondence. Yeah, thanks for telling me, Davey. I was doing you a favor. Didn't think you'd want to know he was in the same state. Yeah, so now what? I just sit back and hope he doesn't figure it out? It's worked so far. He's a time bomb, Dave, and you fucking know it. Well, that's interesting. So... Brad must be another guy with him in the, uh, on the, uh, on the, like, big heist in North Yankton all that time ago. Listen. And so he's the one that actually died, or right. dead. Find out who we're looking for. the grave marked yeah, we need a Michael. Of the and that's why he thought Michael yeah. was dead, because uh, Michael was, was pretending to be dead, and they pretended Brad was in jail. Please, you, Get Michael about. off the no, map. Oh, so, I've got a feeling Trevor will find out at some point. But let's pick another... Take the torture bike. We don't want to take another tooth out. Let's uh, let's let's electrocute him. Take another tooth, please. I will die. Don't do it. When you will kill. You run out of juice. Look at that chub in his pants! Hey, 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 hey! Now? Huh? Now? You ready to talk? I've been ready to talk since the day I got given up the sick of the That's what we were afraid of. So, yeah, 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 this guy we're after, what does he look like? I was built. I was like middle age. Yeah, yeah, it sounds like you're stalling. This better be enough. Middle age, middle height, middle build, whatever. He's dark, okay? He's Azerbaijani, for God's sakes. Look around. That enough for you? Oh, kind of stereotypical, what they, stereotypical about what they think an Asian's gonna look. A um, Asian, and as by yawning, as by yawning, sorry, it's gonna look like. I see a couple guys that are way too old and too fat to be doing a political assassination. We're live. You see anyone? So we've got, we've got a guy there, the woman. Got the guy here doing some funny you dance. Got another guy here. Got another. I know. Got another, oh, got two like? guys there. They look eastern. Perhaps this town looks eastern, Davy. You got to follow the Shah and the Two class of communism to thank for that. Anyone stand out? No, they all kind of blend couple in. Couple guys there. Make a call. Dave. Guy here. We're gonna need some more info on this guy. They're having a party down there. Okay, we need to swap back to Trevor then. <sighs> they ain't we need more than that. Sure, more sure. a better description. I can't even, I can't Sorry, even speak properly. Can't Trevor. even speak properly. Okay, I guess we go for yeah. I guess we go for this now. Oh. It ain't even the biggest tool in the room. What? Oh, oh, come on! Knee shot. Oh my God, that's his kneecap gone. So what have you got for us? Hmm? We need Trev to shake up your memory again. No, 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 no. He's got fear. Oh, he's got, he's got uh -huh. fear. Uh huh. No. I think you're making this up. No, no, I'm not. Huh? No. Yeah. I'm telling the truth. Bushy beard? 
Got any beardy types at this party? Huh? Because that's all Mr. K's given us. Huh, no. You know, I'm thinking maybe we ought to just take two bullets and put them in our informant no. and just call an airstrike on Chumash Beach. I need eyes on that party. Pick up the scope and give me a report. There's a guy here with beard, yeah. Steve saying beard. What do you got? Yeah. Anything specific or is some stubble gonna cut it? Let's and this start guy. at Mountain Men and we'll work our and way this down guy. until someone fits Wait, the and this guy, and now, this guy. There's a few beards at this party. Vinewood's full of weak chins. The place is famous for it. Damn. This guy's got one as well. Oh, and this guy. Wait, they've all got one. Land of beach hipsters. I think they everyone's got a beard more. at this party, apart from the ladies. Okay, back to Trevor. It's time for the last torture punishment. This box. This looks like a fucking chimney. I don't know. Trev, maybe one more time. Just to be sure. No, please, no. Huh? I told you. He smokes. That's all I know. All right. Well, it's the last one. If my mama had waterboarded me more often, I wouldn't be the gun-toting psychopath you see before you now. I was drunk. I will. I got blood in my mouth. I was my, drunk. My, my, my controller's like bracing like crazy. Techniques were a little too advanced. Oh, we need to use the syringe. Oh. The light. Let me go through it. <laughs> Mr. K. Mr. K. I don't know anything, please. Okay. He chain smokes. And he's left handed. What's that? He chain smokes. And he's left handed. Ah, okay. Any of these bearded guys at the party smoke cigarettes? Mr. K says he smokes like a pack of two a day. Red with cigarettes? Thank you, Mr. K. Steve's telling me he chain smokes redwoods. I don't yeah, know what redwoods is going to be. Kill them. It's the guy who's got warnings smoking? on the packets you should worry about. And he's left-handed. Oh, now I. Oh get no, it. he's right-handed. You're telling me to assassinate a guy because he's got facial hair, a cigarette. I swear he's changed his T-shirt. He's left-handed. I swear he used to be in the bread. I'm telling you to assassinate a guy because he's a threat to national security. The rest is right details. She's left-handed. Right-handed. Oi, oi, oi. Left handed. Ah, I see someone. He fits the profile. Yep, fits it all the way. I got a good feeling. Well, as good as you can get while clipping a guy who probably don't deserve it. Now I'm taking the shot. All right. Straight in the middle of his forehead. Hang on when he turns his head back. Wait for it. Davey, I got someone. Definitely a lefty. Redwood smoking, bearded, maybe, could be, used to be, Azerbaijani. Good enough for me. Steve, it's done. Woo! That is a wrap, my friends. Excellent work to the pair of you. Now, I got a racquetball game to get to, so Trevor, if you take care of Mr. K, I think we're all set. What the <coughs> fuck do you want me to do with him? I would say he's outlived his usefulness. Oh, come on, please. Shut up! That's a sport. <coughs> let's go, come on. Wait a second, Mr. Fuck, let's just go, okay? I ain't gonna let those G-Man fucking scumbags tell me what to do. Oh, what? You just tortured me. Don't ask too many fucking questions. Let's go, get up. Come on, up the fucking stairs. <coughs> oh, fuck's sakes. Come on. Let's go. All right. Now you got a flight to catch. Okay? Where's he taking him? To the airport. Oh, the airport. 
Does that want to take him over to the hospital instead? I don't know. I'm going to drop him off at the airport. I guess that's sort of kind of in a way. Hey, how's your mouth? It hurts. Can you speak? Kind of. Are you going to hold it together? I want to go home. I want to see my family. No, 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 no. You have no home. You have no family. That shit is over. I do. They're in the morning wood. I love them very much. No, that's your old life. That's over now. You're off the grid. You're one of the invisible people. Just take me home. I'm taking you to the airport. You're going to get on a plane. You're flying a long way from this country, and you're going to spread your message. I don't have a message. You're a torture advocate. Advocate? The media and the government would have us believe that torture is some necessary thing. We need it to get information, to assert ourselves. Did we get any information out of you? I would have told you everything. Exactly. Tortures for the torturer. Or the guy giving the order to the torturer. You torture for the good times. We should all admit that. It's useless as a means of getting information. I'm feeling lightheaded. Departures. Well, we still the brother. Me. Uh. Run. You're free. Oh, what? But my family's here. Your family is probably the ones who got you fucking in here, all right? Now look, trust no one, all right? You're alone now. Really? Yeah, really. Now let's go. Fuck off. Come on. I <laughs> just falling down the stairs. Brilliant. So Trevor's kind of. I guess it was it kind of nice in a way. I don't know. But that's enough permission down. In fact, actually, I'm just going to show you this in a sec, guys. It's just going to go in there. In fact, it doesn't actually matter. I'm stop here. I'm actually going to show you this, guys. Um, Because I've just shown you it, yeah? If we go to stats, and if we go to 100% checklist, here we go. We can actually see, like, uh, how many missions we've done and that, what we've got to do. I mean, how long we play with each character. So we haven't done a lot with Franklin, but... A lot of the times are exactly correct because sometimes I have left it on and it's been like not even paused, just left on. So that probably counts towards the time limit that I've actually been playing for certain characters for. So that may not be com that's so that's probably not completely accurate. Well, I'm, just, I'm pretty sure it isn't completely accurate. So yeah, but we certainly play with Franklin. We've been playing Trevor longer than Franklin now, according to this anyway. But yeah, as you can see, for the on the checklist, we've got uh, missions, hobbies, and pastimes, stranger freaks, random events, and Mercilaneous, not quite sure what, what like the round events and things like that. It's all the hobbies and past, I haven't done any of them. If you want to see me do any like golf or like play some tennis or anything like that, just let me know in the comments below if you want to see some of that stuff, and I'll be happy to oblige and do and show you that f for you. But um, yeah, we've done 23 out of 69 missions, and we've done two out of 20 strange and freaks. We've got like four of them to do with uh with Trevor, so I might do uh, one or two of them soon but yeah we've got 40 what's that 46 more missions to go so we've got a long way to go in this game yet guys expect a lot more parts a lot 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 more parts this is certainly going to be the longest uh walkthrough with, my, with the amount of episodes um that's for sure and probably ever to be fair <laughs> unless i bring another gta because that probably could be as long as this one uh, so yeah i just want to show you where we're at whereabouts we are at in the game, how far we are into the uh, the story, just to let you guys know. And yeah, with that being said, guys, that is going to be it for the video for this episode. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it as always. Like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. I'm out.